one here. Come on. Welcome to the Olympics. Breathe in. Ah, oh, can you not taste the excitement in the air? Are you going to be like this the whole time we're here? By the gods, yes! I'll try and win quickly, then. Come now, you must be feeling something. <laughs> I'm just having fun with you. Who wouldn't be impressed? It is a place of immortal glory. You can be sure Ira and Zeus will be watching oh. your performance closely. Oh. No pressure, then. Uh, forget that for the moment, and let's enjoy the sights and see what Olympia has to offer. Isn't this magnificent? It's certainly impressive. Though, I'm sad we'll be missing the chariot races. Oh, what I would have given to see that! We should take in the sights and praise the gods to be here at such a time. Which sights should we see? There are so many. Let me think. The Temple of Zeus, the Altar of Zeus, and, of course, the Olympic Tree. We should make an offering to Zeus for good luck in the games. Who <laughs> Talk to him. You think I would see such an offering to the gods in Olympia itself? I've never seen anything like this. And this is nothing. On the final day, the Magiros will slaughter a hundred bulls for the Hecatomb to honor Zeus. I could eat. But that's not for people like us. What's wrong with people like us? Hey, give me some of that meat. The gods won't miss it. I won't anger the gods for your belly. Get lost. Well, then, I think we have spent enough time here. Agreed. Let's go. We're in Olympia. It's only fitting we visit the Temple of Zeus. I heard it's one of the wonders of the world, and sculpted by your friend, Phidias. I'd hardly say friend. Even acquaintance might be pushing it. Can't you just feel the presence of Zeus and Ira when you stand here? I thought it was the wind. Don't mock the gods! I'm sorry. I don't want my feelings to cast a shadow on your day. Don't think yourself as tortured by the gods but as molded for greatness by their hands. I am molded by no one's hands. If the gods know me, they watch in silence. <sighs> Come, let's leave this place. Fortunately for you, 
I have enough faith for the both of us. I'd like to see the Olympic tree. Unbelievable craftsmanship. Much better than the statue in Kefalonia. You brought me to see a tree? Not just any tree. This is the sacred tree from which the winner's cotinos are made. I'd rather have Drachmi than a wreath. A cotinos is no ordinary wreath. The olive branches are harvested by children and taken to the temple of Ira. There, the Helenodike, or judges, make the wreaths. I guess they'll be lighter to carry back to Sparta than gold. At least you see the practicality, if not the wonder, of the Olympic wreaths. Varnavas? Yes? Thank you for this. I hope I wasn't too much of a distraction. No, it was made better by your company. A flock of harpies couldn't dampen my spirits! We are at the Olympics! You're competing, and I believe you'll win! <laughs> Cassandra, please. If these fools break the truce... Thief! You're on to talk, you double-dealing dog! If you don't stop, I'll kill you both to preserve the truce. Now, if someone can tell me what's going on... This dishonorable curse stole from me! Huh. You call me a thief? You're the thief! Enough! I'll ask the questions. Irovodos, what's all this about? This scum robbed me! Scum! I am from an honorable family! Only a lowly Ionian would steal! I said, Irovodos. Uh, yes. I it seems both their treasuries were breached and their valuables stolen. If there's been a theft, why do you suspect each other? Because this... It's a matter of blood. Makar is from an eminent Vorian line. Mighty warriors. ...but rather austere, while Lelech is from Ionian stock. A grand tradition of artists, 
and philosophers. You mean philanderers! Both sides are important. Spoken like a true Ionian. It seems unlikely they would rob each other at the same time. You have to find out who stole their drachmi. I can't believe they would do this to each other. Whatever their issues, they've always respected the Olympic truce. I'll find out what happened and protect the truce. If you prove it, Makar, I will reward you well. As will I, if you bring me evidence of Lelek's double dealing. And what if it's neither of you? Then they will both reward you. Very well. Agreed. Did you see anything? No, no, not nothing. Far less than anything. So you saw something? Well, only if you count torches. But they crept up on me, they did. Must have been at least 30 of them. Torches crept up on you? If there were 30 of them, why isn't the ground stomped flat? Eh, uh, those skin sandals, very soft. Don't leave a trace. Anyway, hard to tell how many, as I was uh, unconscious. It's all right if you ran. Fear can change a man. I wasn't afraid. I was asleep. Oh, I, I mean... I won't tell. But did you see anything? No. Except... Yes? Some torches. Heading east. And you didn't investigate? I didn't want to leave my post. But you'd already been robbed. If I deserted my post, I'd be charged with the reliction of duty. Then I'll let you get back to work. These crypts have been opened. There's no sign of forced entry. Take all that you can carry, and meet me at the ruins where we first consummated our love. Soon we will be free. Outside the city. And from what the guard said, the torches were heading in that direction. I finally catch you. Please, we're not thieves! Yet here you are, with stolen goods. You don't understand. This is rightfully ours. It's our inheritance. 
How can this all be yours? It belongs to our families. By blood, it's rightfully ours. If it's already yours, why not wait? Why steal everything now? We wanted a new life. One where we could be free and our love doesn't have to hide in the shadows. Who are you exactly? They are my daughter and his son! Father! This is how you repay me for raising you? By running off with some woman squirted from my enemy's loins? Why not put aside your feud, as your children have done? You're a mistress. Carry out your duty and kill the thieves. I will pay you handsomely. Pater, no! I agree. I will match Makar's price on this. Do what you were hired to do. You would kill your own son and daughter? <laughs> we have other children. Now, are you a mistress or not? I will not slaughter innocents. Your families would stand a better chance for the future without the both of you. I didn't want it to come to this, but now we can forge a new future for our two families. One built on love. I wish you luck with that. Hey, Mistyos, would you like to learn about your future? The Oracle at Delphi ruined my life. You think I want to hear your lies, too? No worries. How about I clean your sandals? Not today. Then what about your... I don't need anything. Go. Well, no accounting for taste, but shoot yourself. What is it with the Olympics? Everyone's out to make Drachmi. Palaka, my Drachmi! Hey, stop! Thief! Thief! Looks like Phoebe. And as nimble a thief. I have to find her. The sanctuary of Olympia, where the greatest athletes compete for fame and glory. Hey! Come back here! Thief! A street thief. Just like Phoebe.
You led me on a good chase, but I got you. Hand it over. Hand what over? My drachmi. Give it back. Here, please, don't hurt me! They made me do it! I didn't want to! Honest! <laughs> Hush. I'm not going to hurt you. I promise. But the captain will! Captain? Yeah, it's him that makes us do this. Us? The other street kids. Why is he making you steal? For the drachmi, stupid! You should be more polite to adults. Why? What have adults done for me? Fair enough. Sounds like the captain needs a good talking to. Don't talk, just hit. He even stole my mother's necklace from me. Says I'll get it back if I steal from him. It's all that I had left of her. I'll help you get your necklace. Why would you care? You remind me of someone. Someone very special. Strange.
must be Mea's necklace. Well, Laka kept it on him. I should return to Mea. Keeping children in cages? Whoever did this will pay. I got something for you. Thank you, thank you, thank you! What happened to Alopex? You know, the guy who distracted you while I nabbed your purse? I spared him. He's promised to help you and the others. Good, I always liked him. He used to share his food with us and stand up for us when the Athenian got mad. You'll do fine. Take care. <laughs> 